Hey everyone, it is the Angry Honey Badger here, and it is time for Badger's Picks for the week of July 22nd of the year 2014. Let's see who's free this week and what four champions I'm going to recommend. Free this week, we're going to be getting Blitzcrank, Dr. Mundo, Gragas, Kogma, Gnosis, Skarner, Trundle, Urgot, Zareth, and Ziggs. And as for my first pick for this week, throwing it back to Blitzcrank. Now, I know so many people will get angry that I'm recommending Blitzcrank. Oh no, Blitzcrank is a good and a bad champion all at the same time. Now, things that are good about Blitzcrank, late game wise, you get the pick you need on any champion and you make it a 4v5, you can pretty much win a game. He's got great pick potential because of that pull. Now, a lot of people are probably mad I suggested this because they're gonna say it's annoying in lane. I'm sorry, but if you keep like your bush warded or you keep a minion between you and him, you're gonna be safe. Just keep the minion between you and him. And worst case scenario, if he pulls you and knocks you up, he has nothing left to do to you. That's just him then running around in circle standard attacking. So if you can coordinate with either your ADC or your support, you should be able to take out somebody. So um, there are counters to it, but at right now, I think he's a good choice that people are overlooking. As for my next choice champion pick for this week, I'm gonna go with Ziggs. Ziggs has always kind of been in a, a decent part um, when it comes to power in league. Now, they have hit him a few times with a few nerfs in a few areas, but overall, he still gets to late game and does a lot of damage. Um, a few things that help with that are his passive, which is pretty awesome. A lot of people don't realize how fast it really can take turrets, objectives, and just kill people. Um, another nice thing too, obviously, even though they did nerf it a little bit, is his wave clear. Um, it's really, really hard to not siege or siege up against that. So um, Ziggs is really good in this aspect and he's really fun to play too. With a little bird practice, you can do pretty good work with Ziggs. So try him out. My next recommendation for this week is going to be Kogma. Now I actually haven't been playing Kogma too much. And this is actually, I think my oldest build on my channel. It is super old and super outdated because most of the items in the build aren't even in the game anymore. So I need to rework this, I do know that. But I don't play Kogma myself for one reason that you need to be careful about when you do play him. His low mobility. Um, he's got no real hardcore escapes. Now he does do tons of damage late game and at level 6 he has the potential to do a lot of damage too in lane because of that living artillery and all types of other stuff in his kit. So that makes him really good. He is a hyper carry of hyper carries. Um, he's up there with Tristana and Vayne for that late game just annihilation stuff. So. Um, he works really well for that, so you have a, if you have a great peeling team or a team that can stick in front of you and keep you alive, you will do work with Kogma. So that is one of the great things about him, but once again, you gotta be careful. And as for my final pick for this week, I'm gonna go with Zareth. Now we've actually seen him come back into the LCS um, a lot more in recent weeks. It's that range um, that is keeping him safe and with the decent damage from that incredibly increased range duration that he has as a champion um, it, It's put him in a good spot currently. So that is the reason why I like to recommend him You can play safe and still farm and deal damage um, once again it helps to have a big tanky team in front of you Another thing I actually like about Zareth. I think since his little rework. I think he's a lot of fun I know this was back uh, early probably back in like March or February. Um, I made a new build for him back then, and he's just a really fun champion to play. Really surprised me when they reworked him how much fun I actually had playing that champion. So um, besides being good, it's also fun to play. So try him out too. But those are gonna be your champions that are free for this week. It is uh, the week of July 22nd. Um, some decent choices in here. There's actually some other weird stuff in here. Um, still not exactly sure where Skarner fits in the game. Urgot is just a mess of a champion that they're reworking. And uh, other than that, there's some other stuff in here that's kind of fun, I suppose. So obviously, not just try him out. Anyways, play any of those champions that you want to play if you're interested in them so you know how to play them. Obviously, if you click on any of these pictures right now, if they have a box around them, it will take you to a build of some sort for this champion, whether it's quick build or full-length build. But until next time, just good luck out there on the Fields of Justice.